All right, so we got Redfall might be the biggest disappointment of 2023. Let's start the video. What's up, everybody? It's Jamie here, and in today's gaming news, Redfall is looking like I heard a red fail. Xbox is lending you gift in yeah. past trial to a buddy, and the Steam Deck is seeing... I heard a lot about Redfall not really ex uh, succeeding, so... I'm going to give my take at the end, but let's just see what this is about. Today is the day. After two years of waiting and a delay so that we receive the best and most polished version, supposedly, Redfall is here. Not he only talking? is it the latest game from celebrated developer Arcane, it's the first big Xbox exclusive in years, which is all why Redfall is so disappointing. IGN's review right. is in progress because we only got our copy a couple of days ago. But our reviewers' impressions so far are not positive. Luke Riley yeah. writes, after several sessions, solo, co-op with a friend, and also in a group of three, I must admit I'm thoroughly underwhelmed by Redfall's vanilla missions and lifeless world and very disappointed mm. at its lengthy list of display issues and bugs. Okay. It's not just IGN that is underwhelmed. Okay. Reviewers from just about all the big media outlets are finding Redfall disappointing and not up to arcane standards. It has a score of 65 on OpenCritic, the all-video game version of Metacritic, meaning it has received mostly weak reviews and only 24% of critics actually recommend the game. And there were some mm. signs that Redfall was in trouble leading up to release. For one, the IGN audience just didn't seem to be all that interested in it. We know how many yeah. people are reading our articles and watching our videos, and our Redfall content was underperforming compared to other big 2023 games. Mm. And there was the news that the Xbox yeah. version would be capped at 30 frames per second at launch, something a lot of people found unacceptable for a current gen only game. And there was also backlash over Agreed. The that required an always online connection, even when you're playing by yourself. Okay, yeah, I agree. Yeah, I don't like that either. Now, a lot of okay. That than forgiving okay. Redfall had turned out to be an awesome game, but by all accounts, it isn't. The most high profile Xbox release in years is a dud. And here's the thing. Xbox cannot afford a failure like this. True. The last big exclusives were Halo Infinite and Forza Horizon 5 way back in 2021. Yes, I know there was Hi-Fi Rush. I liked, year, I liked Forza and I liked but Halo, but... But the same level as these other releases that Xbox ran years-long promotional campaigns for. For all the money it has and all the studios it owns, Microsoft has a terrible time actually shipping games. So it really got like voted that low though? I didn't know that. It seemed to be in a pretty good place at the start of this generation. It's gone way too long without any exclusive software, and now it's released a subpar product from a beloved studio. Oh, and Xbox hardware sales are down 30% year over year. Really? Not a good look, and Xbox gamers deserve better. IGN's final Redfall review will be up later this week, but it kind of seems like it bites. In other Xbox news, it's okay. a new PC Game Pass referral program okay. that lets existing members gift a free trial of the subscription service to a friend. Is that, is that it for a red? Okay. Here's my thing, right? First of all, listen, here's my thing. Okay. Now, I do have a video. I have a video of 20 minutes, or sorry, 19 minutes of Redfall gameplay, right? I didn't watch that yet. First of all, before I even touch that gameplay, First of all, I've heard that people hated this game. Like, like, like they, okay. I haven't touched the gameplay yet. I haven't watched the gameplay yet. But like, bro, before I even touched it, people were saying they hated it. And it already just gave me like, I mean, obviously at the end of the day, I, I don't let people's like, like opinions just like, you know, just ruin anything. But at the same time though, if everybody's saying, oh, this game is not good. Right. And you know, I'm excited to check it out because the trailers and, and again, right, listen, I told you guys before, man, the trailers, some games, the trailers look really good, right? And the actual gameplay is trash. I've said that in multiple of my trailer reactions. I've said that before, that, you know, a trailer can be top tier, top 10, right? Just just amazing. Hype everybody up. But as soon as you get the gameplay, it's just very uh, just underwhelming, right? When it comes to, um, you know... Um, you know, red like the Redfall just promotion, right? When it comes to that, uh, because I, I think this guy right here he said that um that all the red uh, all the Redfall like trailers and all that uh, like all the content that they you know that they created around that on their channel just underperformed compared to like other big games. I feel like that's just a, that that right there is a promotional problem. That is a that I I think in my opinion that is a promotional problem, um because in my opinion I was really excited for it. Um, but when it comes to something like that, you can't really control it. I mean, unless you put a, a lot of money behind your promotion, then, and you know, then obviously it's most likely going to succeed, uh, because you're trying to get it out everywhere and anywhere, you know, you're trying to get as, as many eyes as, uh, on it as, you know, as you want or as you need it to be. Um, but when it came down to, it, I was really excited. You know, I reacted to about two, 
Redfall trailers on my channel, I think. And um, uh, in both trailers, I was like, hey, man, this looks good, but this is only the trailer. I kept, I had to, listen, I had to keep telling myself, okay, this is the trailer. You cannot get the trailer mixed in with the gameplay, right? And I kept saying, okay, yeah, man, this looks good. I can't wait for this to come out. I want to see some gameplay of this, blah, 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 right? And as soon as it comes out, everybody's saying it's trash. Um, w one, Another thing that I don't like, I don't like uh, that that games if it's like an online game obviously it requires online uh, it requires like internet connect, uh, internet con uh, connection but if it's not an online game or like it has a story mode and it has like an online game so if it, uh, for example like gta um or gta 5 you don't really need an internet connection to play gta 5 you can just play the story mode and you, honestly bro it, it's you can just play the story mode Honestly, you can play that thing over and over again if you really want to. Like, the story mode is really big enough to a point to where, like, you will, like, I don't know. It, it depends on, like, what type of person you are. But, like, you know, you really don't need, like, an online connection for GTA Five. You really don't. You, like, unless you want to, like, play online, whatever. I don't like when games require you to have, like, ha have, like an internet connection to, like, a story mode field game. I don't like that. Me, personally, I really don't. Um, but you know, going back to Redfall, you know, I, 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 I just, I don't know. I'm confused because uh, again, I have a 19 minute gameplay thing that I have, uh, in the vault, right. That I haven't even like reacted to. We need to react to it. Right. Cause I want to get my own opinion on it. I don't just want to sit here and go off of anybody, everybody else's opinion, even though everybody's saying that the game is, you know, not good. Right. And you no, know, it's taken two years and they, you know, they pushed it back and stuff like that. And, um, I don't know, man. I don't know. I got to check it out for myself. Uh, remember, I have a 19-minute uh, gameplay. Make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Um, the whole thing about uh, the quality capping out at 30 frames per second, people are saying that it's unacceptable. I mean, I have to I have to agree with that, man. Uh, we are in 2023 where, you know, most games are uh, at 60 frames, uh, especially if the game is on, you know, if it's on a new Xbox or if it's on a PS5. Uh, yeah, 30 frames is not really going to be, um, acceptable. Um, you know, but that's just me being honest though. You know, I, I don't want to sit here and just, you know, hate and shame on, you know, um, you know, gaming companies and, you know, and developers, you know, cause that's just not who I am. But at the same time, I'm not going to lie to y'all though. I'm always going to give my, you know, opinion. Uh, but from the gameplay that, that was in this video, like, uh, like the few seconds of gameplay, whatever. Okay. My thing is right. It didn't look too bad. It didn't look too bad. I thought from the reviews and from what everybody was saying, I thought that this game was just dirt water. Like it looked, it just looked terrible. Right. And I, I, I mean, I don't know if it looks terrible, but like from that clip that he's shown, it didn't look that bad, but that's for me though. You know, like, you know, everybody's different when it came, when it comes to like, you know, what they like and stuff like that. Um, but again, we have 19, uh, 19 minute, you know, full gameplay, uh, video that I have. We will react to that. Um, Am I going to be too overly like critical or, or, or whatnot? Maybe. I mean, but at the same time, though, um, just know I'm not going to be hating anybody. I'm not going to, oh, the developers, they need to just quit their job. Like, I'm not, I swear to God, I'm not, I, I swear to God, I'm not like that. I promise you, I'm not like that. I find that really cringe uh, for you to just come at the developers. You know, it, it's just like, uh, like, again, criticism is something you fully insulting them because, you know, you don't like the game, whatever. That's just lame, in my opinion. But, you know, we're, we're all different. But, um, yeah. I'm kind of excited a little and a little nervous to check out, you know, the gameplay because, yeah. But we're going to go on it. We're going we're, <laughs> we're gonna to go at this trailer or not trailer. We're going to go at this gameplay, which is high hopes, okay? I don't know, bro. Everybody was just dubbing it down. And, and I didn't even see no gameplay. I purposely didn't see no gameplay so I could watch it with you guys. We're going to see, though. Honestly, we're gonna see. We're gonna see how it is, and um, yeah, man. Comment down below what you guys think of Redfall. Um, honest, give me your honest opinion. Is it Xbox exclusive? Um, and yeah, it's out right now. So um, so yeah, we're gonna see what it looks like. Um, in the in the next in the next video, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm so I'm so scared right now. It's cause I don't know, man. I don't know. Okay. Other than that, see you later for the next one. I'm out and. Peace. Oh, man, I'm scared. Subscribe to the channel, by the way, or we will literally run the fade outside. And guess what? I'm winning. I'm winning the fight. It really doesn't matter. All right. Peace out. See you.